Good day! This is Group 2 reporting for the topic of the importance of quantitative research across fields. Before we commence our reporting, let us pause for a moment of silence and acknowledge the presence of God. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Mighty and loving Father, Creator of heaven and earth, we praise you and adore you. You are the King of kings. We humbly ask your forgiveness for our sins. Have mercy on us, O Lord. We are gathered here today for our research discussion. Send us your Holy Spirit to be our guide and give us the wisdom to understand every topic that we are going to discuss. Enlighten our minds and let your love be upon us. May this discussion bring success and growth to our team. We thank you, our Father, for this precious time that you have given us. All this we pray through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Before we get into our topic, let us first assess your prior knowledge on our topic for today. Number one. In what field does the discovery and development of vaccines belong? A. Social science B. Natural and physical science Or letter C. Medical science Number 2. In what field does the prevention and cure for crops and livestock diseases belong? Letter A, Natural and Physical Science B, Agriculture and Fisheries Letter C, Physical Science Number 3 In what field does the understanding of cultural and racial conflicts belong? Letter A, Social Science Letter B, Sports Or Letter C, Medical Science Number 4 In what field does the contribution to the enhancement of athletic performance of sports players belong? Letter A. Sports. Letter B. Medical science. Or letter C. Social science. Number five. What research method develops and employs mathematical models theories and or hypothesis pertaining to phenomena. Letter A, qualitative research. Letter B, quantitative research. Or letter C, practical research. Let us see if what you answered is right. Listen and pay attention to our reporting. And in the end of our discussion, assess if what you answered is correct. Qualitative research is more popular method than qualitative research because it is scientific, objective, faster, more focused, and easier to comprehend. Hence, 
Quantitative methods are used by researchers to observe situations or events that have an impact on people. Its objective is to understand, analyze, describe, and give prediction to products or services, and even discover new things. Quantitative research allows people to understand the dynamics of changes to do in their products or services respectively. Also to develop and employ mathematical model, theories, and or hypothesis pertaining to phenomena. Research findings affect people's lives, ways of doing things, rules and regulations, as well as policies among others. Widely, quantitative research is often used because of its emphasis on proof rather than discovery. People conduct research to find solutions to problems, even negative solutions, in order to improve or enhance the way things are done. They refute or provide hypotheses or simply find answer to solve daily problems in life. The importance of quantitative research across fields deals with many explorations among studies that results to vast discoveries of meaningful and necessary contribution to mankind. A basic example of its discovery can be found in various fields of studies such as social science, natural and physical science, agriculture and fisheries, sports, and medical science. There are many contributions in quantitative research in various fields. One is in the field of social science where the primary aim of the study is to understand cultural and racial conflicts and to study the human satisfaction and the stressure that is commonly happening nowadays in this time of uncertainty and amidst this pandemic. Another one is on the third of natural and physical sciences that investigates the effectiveness of a product for treatment analysis and also in the advancement in material science. Furthermore, they are also in the fields and agriculture and fences, where they increase the health of crops and provide food raw materials for the rest of economy and also the prevention and cure of crops and livestock disease. Another field is on sport where it contributes to the enhancement of athletic performance of sport players. Moreover, it also contributed in the field of medical science, wherein it paved the way to the development and discovery of many vaccines, including the COVID-19 vaccines. Every scientist and medical experts all over the world today are doing their best to fast track the development, testing, and the release of vaccines for the coronavirus disease of 2019, or what we call the COVID-19. As pandemic has critically affected the world's economy, education, as well as the physical and emotional well-being of people.
To wrap up the lesson, let us assess what you have learned from our discussion. You must choose the letter of the correct answer. Number 1. In what field does the discovery and development of vaccines belong? A. Social science B. Natural and physical science or Letter C. Medical science Great! The correct answer is letter C. Medical science. Number two. In what field does the prevention and cure for crops and livestock diseases belong? Letter A. Natural and physical science. B. Agriculture and fisheries. Or letter C. Physical Science Awesome! The correct answer is letter B Agriculture and Fisheries Number 3 In what field does the understanding of cultural and racial conflicts belong? Letter A. Social science. Letter B. Sports. Or letter C. Medical science. Excellent! The correct answer is letter A, social science. Number four, in what field does the contribution to the enhancement of athletic performance of sports players belong? Letter A, sports. Letter B, Medical Science or Letter C, Social Science Incredible! You got the correct answer. It's Letter A, Sports. Number 5. What research method develops and employs mathematical models, theories, and or hypotheses pertaining to phenomena? Letter A. Qualitative research. Letter B. Quantitative research. Or letter C. Practical research. Fantastic! You got the correct answer again! The answer is letter B, quantitative research. To wrap up our lesson, let us have Ms. Rhea to take lead in concluding this reporting. Quantitative research is important to various fields of studies because by conducting it, either we get to discover new things or yet to develop things into more functional and beneficial to mankind. Hence, by simply giving importance to your research or any related work will surely result to one's improvement in any fields. <laughs> 